This is a video from everystepphysics.com demonstrating how my programs work on the TI-89 Titanium calculator and other calculators in the TI system for physics and calculus problems. Here's a problem that's on uh, many tests in physics and uh, it's a bullet of a mass 20 grams traveling at 350 meters per second strikes a steel plate at an angle of 30 degrees as shown it ricochets off with the same angle and at the speed of 320 meters per second what is the magnitude of the impulse that the plate gives the bullet and in my programs uh, you find first what the problem is asking. In this case it's asking impulse and you go to my menu and you, and you scroll down for impulse and then you on the side of your problem instead of looking at or thinking about the problem at all you just put what's given here which is mass 20 grams and initial velocity which is 350 meters per second. Uh, final ve velocity would be 320 meters per second and then 30, 30 degree angle. And here's the picture of what's happening. And this is really vector addition. So let's get uh, started here. Uh, you have to press second alpha to put these letters in here to get to my program menu. P-H-Y-S-I-C-S -S, and then you have to press alpha again to put the open and close parentheses and press enter and you're into my menu. I've scrolled down to impulse here to save some time but you start it brings you to the top of the menu and then you have all these other choices and um, we get to impulse we press enter it gives you these variables here for impulse and right now in this problem we want the mass the initial velocity the final vo velocity and the angle we choose that we enter your your variables we have to press alpha first before we enter any variables into these entry lines of my program so I'm going to press alpha and put down put in 20 it also might give you kilograms or grams in this case it gives you the bullet is grams so I'm going to put that there it shows you that you take 20 and divide it by a thousand to get 0 0.02 kilograms which is necessary for the formula and the initial velocity, you're going to press alpha and put in 350. That's the where the bullet is traveling. And it's not in centimeters, it's in meters, so we're going to choose number two. You can press or scroll to that choice. Final velocity, alpha 320. Meters again per second. And then the angle is alpha 30. I always show you what you've entered so you can change it. This looks good to me. It's been changed from grams into kilograms, etc. And this is vector addition. Who would have known that if you just saw the problem in a test? Uh, here's the impulse vector resultant uh, is the square root of the x-axis and y-axis. And the i is the impulse. And here's the formula and then we add it adds the all the variable you just write this on paper you don't think about it and the iy is 6.7 new per second and the answer is 6.7231 newton second pretty neat huh every step physics.com go to my site by my programs and pass physics